the lack of inventory space is starting to bite a little. Raw pork, breakfast of champions. As you can see, my dining mine, diamond mining expedition was rather successful, despite being pretty dangerous most of the time. It ended up being mostly a cave full of lava and creepers, but fortunately that too was lost to the Great Fail. Yeah, so this would probably be a good time to not be out here. I still don't know about this new cobblestone texture. And by don't know, I mean I hate it. Ah, stop it. Oh my god, stupid torches. I'll waken from my sleep inside my mausoleum here. Okay, uh, this is uh, interesting. I'm going to assume this is a lake that got formed inside the ocean. Or perhaps it was sand collapse. Which, if so, means there's likely a cave under there. No, no, this is dirt down here. Also, it's dark. Well, apparently the water decided to take a little bit of a vacation from these spots.
There are apparently self-heating roses here. And now suddenly we're in a desert instead of a icy wasteland. Minecraft is a strange place where most lakes are underground. be having performance issues, probably just from generating the new terrain, but it is annoying. Spooky. Expecting sooner or later to have a full stack of iron blocks. Already up to 30. Well, this is a exciting dead end. I am sorry, water, but you are not tolerable.
don't know if I should bother trying to get the rest of that right now. The change to needing TNT or redstone to set off TNT is understandable and even useful. It's better to be able to pick it back up again, but it also means I now have to carry redstone everywhere. Again, not terribly exciting here. Results? Not very much, except to waste the whole day. I guess going back in there and hiding is a good idea. If I can find where in there was. I suppose this will have to do.